Welcome back. It is 518 on this marvelous Monday. My name is Josephine Sage and I've got your forecast. If we want to take a look at America's Mattress Live Tower Cam right now, it's very dark outside and we didn't really expect the, that sunrise until just shy of 7 a.m. Now when that sun comes up on over the Mesa, we're going to expect mostly clear skies with just a little bit of scattered clouds throughout our day. Now also we're going to expect mild autumn uh, patterns to remain in place, rain and snowfall over the higher elevations today and a possible chance for storms toward the end of the work week. But until then, we're expecting quite mild weather. Also on the way, Thanksgiving folks, 10 days away. Um, it's next Thursday, and so make sure you get to those stores, get all those uh, fixings that you need for you and your family gatherings. Right now, our temperatures are looking to be 30 degrees in Grand Junction as well as Montrose. And in our higher elevation areas, a little bit on the cooler side, 17 degrees in Gunnison, 26 in Aspen, even 28 in Glenwood Springs. Now, those are just shy of our seasonal averages. We're looking at a usual 53 in Grand Junction for our high, the usual low of 28. Now, earlier today, we did hit a low of 21 degrees, so definitely a little bit on the cooler side. And we're going to be between 10 and 15 degrees shy of our seasonal averages for today as well as for the rest of our week. Now also our afternoon highs today we're looking at 36 in Montrose so definitely a little bit on the cooler side and in our higher elevation areas we're only going to get up to 30 in Aspen and also again 36 in Gunnison. So we're getting really close to those freezing points not only here on the western slope but also in those higher elevation areas. And tonight between basically when the sun goes down around 5:30 to 7 a.m. when the sun comes up, we're looking to get down into a cool 23 in Grand Junction, 16 in Delta Montrose, even a cool 5 degrees in Gunnison and 10 in Aspen. So we're looking for those chillier temperatures as November crawls on and even towards the end of the work week when we get a chance for another round of showers it's going to be a little bit on the cooler side now most of our clouds are going to be centered over uh, to the east of us today and uh, throughout the next couple of days but here on the western slope we might be getting a little bit of cloud coverage but mostly clear skies as we continue on now we're also going to expect some pretty mild winds today six miles an hour in grand junction right now no my or no wind in uh, montrose right now we don't really expect to exceed more than 10 to 15 miles an hour at most uh, uh, as those clouds kind of move on through the western slope now with those winds and those cooler temperatures expected especially below our seasonal averages we're looking to have a wind show uh, 24 in Grand Junction right now, a cool 10 in Gunnison. So definitely um, on the cooler side and keep that in mind in those early morning hours. Now we did have a closed mid-low move over New Mexico today and it's going to continue to move and take all of these storm clouds over southern Colorado. So southern Colorado can expect a little bit of rainfall and a little bit of snowfall today and soon we are going to on the western slope as well. If you want to see here, we're going to get down to 21 degrees come Thursday, Friday and then even on the weekend and get down into those low teens. Now, Montrose has that same temperature trend where we're going to get even down into 14 degrees come Wednesday with a chance for showers uh, come the end of the work week and into the weekend with those cooler temperatures sticking around with us. 